I'm Dr. Jeff Waldron and today I'm going to talk about some dynamic running drills. A lot of people still out there are going and they're doing static stretching where they're pushing, stretching their hamstrings or the quads like so. And we have a lot of evidence that doing a dynamic warm-up is a little bit better for your muscles. It turns them on so the muscles are activated and then getting a stretch at the same time. So here's a nice series of of exercises that will get you out on the trails and keep you healthy, turning on your hips, your stomach, and your core, in addition to some of the other muscles that you don't typically turn on when you're running. So I hope you enjoy this, and it's a beautiful day in Edmonds to get out for a run. Reaching opposite arm and leg, and then you just jog back. So when you're coming out, just make sure you're reaching opposite, getting a little bit of trunk rotation. Catch out your quads, and just kick your butt. Add a little speed to it if you want. It is internal and external rotation, so you're coming in and then going, and then you do a little skip, and then going back, you do the internal skip and out, just like that. Okay, the next one is the opposite direction. You're gonna go outside in, with your hips this way with a little bit of skip, so it looks like this. You swivel towards the direction, coming around like so, and reversing. That gets the upper lower body coordinated. The next one is a lunge rotation. So you go here, you rotate towards the leg that's in front. Try not to let this come in on that side. Keep your legs parallel. And row, jog, jog. Lunge, rotate. Jog, jog, jog. Lunge, rotate. And you can go ahead and switch it up. Rotate. And rotate. Okay, this next one, you're gonna run down. Go down into a lunge and come back. Okay, this is the last running drill. It's really nice to see if people are ruddering when they're running and their elbows are flayed out for balance. I'll have them run with their arms crossed and see if they get this reciprocal twisting through their trunk. It looks kind of silly, but basically you're running like so. And you're just working on that same runner's ready position where you're stepping and twisting as you run and making sure that you're not tipping side to side with your running mechanic. I hope you enjoyed these dynamic running drills and you're able to implement these as part of your practice when you're out running. Just use them at the beginning of your run as you start slowly and you're getting warmed up and getting a good sweat going. And then do the exercises, get your muscles warmed up, and then you can cruise up to your normal speed when you're running. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please share it with your friends and family so they can get out and be active. Thanks for watching.